Read reviews. Understanding the phrase in English. Hello everyone, and welcome to today's English learning video. Today, we're going to explore a phrase that might seem a bit puzzling at first. Read reviews. We'll break down its meaning, usage, and context to help you understand how and when to use it. So, let's get started. At first glance, read reviews might sound like it's about evaluating a type of plant. However, in reality, it's likely a mishearing or misspelling of the more common phrase, read reviews. This misunderstanding is a great example of how English can sometimes be confusing due to similar sounding words. Read reviews refers to the action of examining evaluations or opinions about a product, service, or experience. These reviews are often found online and help consumers make informed decisions. It's a phrase commonly used in the context of online shopping, traveling, or trying out new services. Let's see how read reviews is used in real life situations. One, before buying a new smartphone, I always read reviews online to ensure I'm making a good choice. Two, choosing a restaurant, let's read reviews on Yelp before we decide where to eat. Three, booking a hotel, have you read reviews about the hotel to check if it's good? These examples illustrate how read reviews is an integral part of everyday decision making in the digital age. Beware of confusing read with read. Remember, read refers to a type of tall, slender leaved plant, while read is the act of looking at and comprehending written or printed material. This mix up is a classic example of a homophone, words that sound the same but have different meanings. Thank you for joining me in this exploration of read reviews and its correct form, read reviews. I hope this video has clarified this common English language mix up and will help you use the phrase correctly in the future. Keep practicing and don't forget to read reviews before making your next big decision. See you in the next video.